Good morning, or I should really say good afternoon. It's about 12.20 in the afternoon. I'm in Michigan. I flew up this morning from Florida to Detroit Metro Airport. Got a rental car from Alamo 2021 Nissan Versa. It had 15 miles on it when I picked it up. So basically another brand new car that I'm driving from a rental. Reason that I'm in Michigan today, I'm going to a Luke Bryan concert tonight in Mount Pleasant, Michigan at a casino that I can't remember the name of off the top of my head. But that's in like that very central part of Michigan. If you take away the Upper Peninsula and the rest of Michigan, like the hands, this is in the uh, central part of it. So I'm driving up there now kind of a roundabout way because I had some time. I'm still tired because I had a 6 a.m. flight out of Orlando. I live in the Tampa area, so by the time I you know, got done what I was doing last night and drove up there, I didn't sleep very much. So I just took a nap in the car for a little while at a highway rest area on I-75 North, uh, just outside Flint, Michigan. And that was the most crowded highway rest area I have seen in my life. I mean, it, granted it was a small rest area, but the line for the men's room was out the door of the men's room, and the line for the women's room was out the door of the building. Never seen that before. Memorial Day weekend, people on the road. Gas is high here in Michigan. Uh, 305 to 309 is what I've been seeing so far. It's still in the two, you know, if you're careful in Florida, you can get in the 260s still right now. So I'm, I'm freezing. I'm wearing a hoodie and jeans for the first time in a few months. You know, go from 90-something degree weather every day in Florida up here. It's uh, 60 degrees right now, according to the car, but that's as warm as it's gotten. It was about 41 when my flight landed in Detroit this morning. It was in the 50s for a while. High is like 63, I think, today. The concert's outdoors, so it's going to be... It's gonna be cold. It's gonna be like low 50s, upper 40s during the concert. A Florida boy ain't used to that. But I'm here, wanted to get away this weekend. Just driving right now, because I thought it'd be kind of cool to just go as far north as time allows today before I have to circle back to the concert in Mount Pleasant. So I'm just on I-75 heading north, just outside Saginaw, Michigan. I'm gonna go see that, because I've never been there before. Probably going to go up and see the lake. Um, yeah. This is Saginaw, Michigan. Jumped off the highway here because somewhere I've never been, just wanted to see it. One of these older, northern, you know, small to mid sized cities. old AT&T building like so many cities have. Saginaw is a pretty quiet place. Not a whole lot going on. Cars right here. There's the back of that AT&T building I was talking about. Downtown's like over that way. I just got out of the car, stretched my legs for a little bit. Nice park down here on the riverfront. I'm basically just killing time till the concert. It's about 1.30, uh, maybe an hour from the concert. Uh, the concert's not till eight. And I have an assigned seat, reserved seating, so I don't have to go super early for general admission. And I was sitting in the car, like looking at maps, like trying to figure out what I wanted to do today that was somewhat on the way to the concert. And I couldn't really come up with a whole lot. This is the Saginaw River. Driving around Saginaw, I just can't help but feel like this is just another one of those like northern, old cities with not a whole lot of economic activity going on. I've seen so many of these. It's not bad. It's not unsafe here. Um, it's just the middle of the day and the downtown streets are quite literally deserted. I've been sitting here like texting and on my phone for upwards of a half hour and not one single car has come by. And you could throw a baseball to like the center of downtown from here. 
But anyhow, I'll show you guys whatever I end up doing next. I still have quite a bit of time before the concert. It's a while later. Haven't really done much since the last clip. Got really tired and found a parking lot. Just was sleeping in the car. Now I'm off to the concert. It's about 50 minutes from here. <laughs> It's cold. It's cold. The concert was really good. Um, I had a, you know, halfway decent seat. I wasn't right in the front, but I, I wasn't, you know, way up on the lawn either. So it was really fun. It was Luke Bryan's first concert in a year and a half. First live performance in front of fans. And that was pretty cool to be there because his radio singles from the past year hadn't played him to an audience yet and I got to hear all of them he even mentioned that on stage like some of these songs are you guys are the first group that's getting to hear them so that was pretty cool the show was really good um, I stayed in the casino for a couple hours after the show which I was gonna do anyway played some penny slots this was actually a pretty good casino the slots were pretty loose this is probably my second favorite casino after Sam's Town. I'll put this right up there with Sam's Town and Boomtown. Sam's Town's in Vegas, Boomtown's in Biloxi. But I, I would put this like two or three. There was a lot of penny slots. There was a lot of uh, variety for penny machines. And they were really loose. I played, you know, right now after the concert, a couple hours. I played an hour or so before the concert. And in like three hours and change. I was up four dollars and on penny slots that's pretty good it was fun um, so yeah just late at night concert was awesome according to the car it's 44 degrees I would say it feels even colder than that but again Florida boy ain't used to this crap you know going from you know 90 some odd degrees every day to a high of you know 59 60 here in Michigan today and now it's, I don't know, the car says it's 44, but I'm pretty certain it's got to, it feels colder than 44. But anyhow, I have a 10 a.m. flight in the morning from Detroit Metro back to Orlando, which is where my pickup truck is parked at the Orlando airport. And yes, I do live in the Tampa Bay area, but I flew out of Orlando because it was half the price. In Orlando Airport, the parking's only $10 a day, so that's not too bad. So, yeah, I'm just going to get on the road, drive until I uh, need to take a nap. But there was a 6 a.m. flight I could have gotten home tomorrow and a 10 a.m. flight I could have gotten home tomorrow for the same price. I opted for the 10 a.m., so I figured it would be a little bit more time to sleep along the way, which is something I usually wish I had on these trips. I actually have it this time. And I don't got to, um, you know, I have Monday off too. I'm coming home Sunday like I usually do on these trips. But Memorial Day, Monday's a holiday, so I don't got to do nothing on Monday. So if I get home a little later on Sunday, who cares? But yeah, real good concert, good time. If you look at Michigan on a map, 
take away the Upper Peninsula. Just look at, you know, the hand and with, with the thumb part of Michigan. I'm in, like, almost the geographic center of that hand. This is uh, Soaring Eagle Casino, Mount Pleasant, Michigan. I'm going to work my way back towards Detroit Metro Airport and catch a nap at highway rest area somewhere. And I'll probably grab something to eat along the way, too. So thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys in a bit. All right, so it was the old usual situation that always seems to happen on these trips. I drive a little while after the event, and I get tired. That's exactly what happened. I slept in a park-and-ride lot for a few hours. Lots of park and ride commuter lots in Michigan for some reason, like more so than any place I've ever been. So as soon as I get tired, it's like two minutes later, there's a parking lot. So I slept there for a while and got up, drove some more, um, got down to this rest area that I'm at right now on I, I think this is, hang on. Yeah, I'm still waking up. I had to check the map. This is I-96. I came south and uh, went through Lansing. Turn east on I-96, and I'm headed back to the Detroit Metro Airport. And I slept for another hour or two here. It's about 7.40 in the morning. My flight's at 10.20. So just time to head back to the airport, return this car, and fly home to Florida. Very, very, very good trip. According to the car, it is 33 degrees right now. It said it was 35 earlier. And I believe it. It's cold. Can't wait to get back to Florida. I had a great trip, don't get me wrong, but I'm ready to get back to Florida and be warm. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys a little bit later. Or if I get lazy and don't record anything else, this will be the end of the video. But either way, thanks for watching.